channel so obviously I look like a complete mess as you can guess on the title it's I want my makeup overnight what do I do I thought about this this morning after I realised I wore my makeup overnight I'd like to point out I didn't have the lipstick on or this I did do that as a little bit of an extreme for the thumbnail but I did go to sleep with my makeup on and it's nothing to be ashamed of or embarrassed of it happens to many many people and it's just a part of life really and it's just like you kind of go through the panic of oh god what do i do like my skin's gonna be so bad well firstly luckily my skin didn't doesn't seem to have broken out or if it has it's literally like so tiny that i can't even realize it but then also it's simple to kind of sort out and if you do get a breakout it'll be gone in like two three days depending on how stubborn your skin is obviously if your skin's like fairly easy it'll go like a day if it's a little bit more stubborn maybe a week or longer but don't panic like that is the first thing just don't panic it's nothing to stress about it happens get over it and the best thing you can do is just get your makeup remover for me it's micellar water, obviously other people it's wipes, I think some people use a flannel with I don't know what but just go over your face with makeup remover or yeah just makeup remover, any sort of makeup remover that works for your skin or that you usually use and just wipe your face. And I'm going to go to the part where I've not added anything for the extras of the thumbnail. So let's go into my cheek. And you might not be able to notice but I have got foundation off. We'll go over to the side. And I've got foundation off. There is still, yes there is still foundation, there was still foundation on my skin. But you can easily remove it. Now let's go with the other lips. I barely wear red lipstick and I'm not kidding and you can probably tell that by my Instagram if and if you're not already following me I will put my Instagram snapchat Twitter up there so you can follow me remove your makeup and make you just take care of your skin like hydrate it refresh it that sort of thing and it's nothing to worry about honestly and also getting a spot isn't the end of the world like I know it might seem it but it's not it really isn't And I will point out this really well the last minute video I did. I'm, I'm saying take off your makeup because you might want to put more makeup on today. And or, you, or if you're going bare skin, that's completely fine. But you might want to put make, more makeup on today. And it's best if you don't just layer it. Obviously... There are probably people who do, but don't, just don't, don't layer it. Because, as you can see, my skin even more refreshed than ever. And healthy, dewy, should probably go around my forehead again, because that's where I kind of, because I put foundation and that sort of thing into the hairline. Like, if there are areas where 
the makeup collects more go over it again and it's just simple like having accidentally slept in makeup it's fine people are gonna do it like everyone's gonna do it at least once in their life unless you're like the odd one out then you're kind of lucky but if you do it like it doesn't and also when I say sleep and makeup it doesn't have to be like a full face I did accidentally fall asleep with a full face but you could just be highlighter lipstick even if it's liquid lipstick you've slept in makeup and just easy and yeah obviously I'm kind of more gearing this towards like you've got highlighter bronzer blush that sort of thing on your face but you could even do it for mascara like if you really want to take care of your lashes and you've accidentally kept mascara on overnight you're going to want to take it it's going to be a lot better just to take it off than reapply on top because if you reapply on top it's not going to look as nice it's not going to look as silky smooth and fresh as it did the day before but yeah that's my little quick simple tip on like what you should do if you've gone to sleep wearing makeup and like the best way to deal with it and if you're going to take any tip from this it is don't panic just don't panic and it's self-explanatory really and yeah if you liked this sort of video or you like these videos give us a thumbs up try and get this video to 10 likes I was supposed to shout out someone that was many videos ago because I know I'm supposed to shout out someone I'll leave the shout out in the description box because I can't remember her name at the moment like I've got a name in my head but I'm not sure whether it's a great person but yeah and if you haven't subscribed already hit that subscribe button and any video ideas comments or tips you've got for any other people or any little corrections you want to make to me like any constructive criticism leave it and yeah I will see you guys in my next video Bye!